Alright guys, I'm back with another review. This is an update from one of the ROMs I did a little bit back. This is AOKP Jelly Bean version on the GSM Galaxy Nexus. This is an update because there's been a few, you know, different mods that's been done so far. Let's go ahead and jump right into oops, let's go ahead and jump right into settings and go to about phone. And as you can see, Android 4.1.1 AOKP. This is the 0801 version for August 1st. They've updated the About Phone. They've done a little bit in the hardware. Not sure why this isn't focusing. Big sad. Alright, and let's go back. So, the main points of this ROM is in ROM control. And they have added a lot. I remember the first, like, it had like maybe two options in here. So, we have enable volume panel. So, when you hit that, you see that there's no little settings next to it. Now there is. So we can change all of the uh, volumes. And let's go back. LED options. We can change how long it blinks on. Let me go back. This may help out a little bit. Alright, let's go back into ROM control now. Now that you can actually see it. If you tap up here, you can change the color that it blinks just gonna set that how, how long it's on how long it's off you can change it to maybe six seconds and you can also have it flash while the screen is on when you go to clock you can choose clock style right clock center or no clock have a.m. p.m. you have the pro tech clock where everything is nine if you don't know anything about that just ignore that um, then small weekday Let's go to toggles. Here are some of the enabled toggles. So for any toggles that you need, I don't really use Bluetooth. I normally only have six up here. So let's disable some of these. Auto rotate, okay. You don't need silent if you have vibrate. I don't need sync. And that's six. Although I want to kind of turn that one off. And let's turn data on. So if I want to say data, I just click this and drag it up there. And you can change the order of your toggles. You can have toggle style. I like the icon only. And I prefer these. Let's go back. Let's go to battery. Battery icon style. Icon text, icon with text, icon with center see it. battery percentage in the center up there and circle mod um, battery bar you can have it on top of your navigation bar which are those down there or the bottom or on top of status bar oh and battery and notifications so I use have a center mirrored because I, th I just think that looks better than if it being all the way at the right um, you can have a charging animation, you can change the color, thickness, etc. Let's go to navigation bar. You can have up to five. I normally have four. I normally set this to recent. I leave that home and I change that to back and I change this to menu. And then when, when I long press on menu, I have it locked the screen because it makes it easier. Then menu button, I move it. And there we go. Let's go back. Let's go back. See if any specific apps come with this. Um, not seeing any. It does come with Nova Launcher and music. So, it comes with like the old kind of music. It comes with Super SU instead of Super User. Let's go to the camera app. 
if I don't throw my phone. I don't know, I, I need to clean my screen. I, I actually cleaned it a little bit ago, but. So, I mean, it touches the focus and it takes the picture really quickly. Here's the lock screen. Power menu. You get the reboot options and to recovery. And I will show you guys how to install this. I, w I will provide links in the description for you guys to be able to download this. This is uh, the Euroscan Chrome off, off their website, in case you were wondering. Alright, so first thing you want to do is go down to Wipe Data Factory Set. Go down to Yes. Hit Yes. Go to Wipe Data. I mean, Wipe Cache. Hit Yes. Go to Advanced. Wipe Dalvik Cache. And hit Yes on Wipe Dalvik Cache. I've already installed the ROM, so I'm not going to wipe, but then you're going to find where you downloaded this ROM. I put this ROM in my download folder. Then you're going to want to go to AOKP underscore Maguro underscore August 1st, 2012. And then you're going to click Yes to install. Then when all that's done, you're just going to hit Reboot System Now. It, so, I mean, it is a pretty simple installation process. This video was just to give you guys an update to the build that I did earlier, which was a few days back. They have gone back to the bigger um, boot up animation, by the way. You can see how fast that booted up. One thing before I end this video is the wallpapers. Um, just Freeboot has updated their wallpapers. So let me go through these and show you guys. Wow, I, I like that. Show you guys the wallpapers. And there are a lot. Wow, that's a lot of wallpapers. I like that one. That one just looks sweet. So, that was my quick look at AOKP on the GSM Galaxy Nexus.